United Nations Children's Fund and Nigeria's National Emergency Management Agency have called on the six states of Nigeria's northeast region to prioritize development of emergency preparation strategies and risk analysis mechanisms in response to emerging threat. This effort aims to enhance early warning system, improve response capacities, and prioritize the protection of vulnerable population, particularly children and women. Our correspondent, Umaru Kirawa, tells us more. Displacement and natural disasters are some of the challenges confronting the six states of the northeast Nigeria. This gathering by experts on disaster risk management emphasized the importance of proactive measures to ensure the safety and well-being of the citizenry. As every year we have outbreaks cholera, but in 2023 uh, there were recorded 3,000 cases of cholera, out of which 3% were fatal, case, fatal cases. Right. So you see the need to have these contingency plans. You see the need to, to, to protect our community as well. Well, the, the, of course, uh, responding to the, to, the, to the crisis, to the hazard, to the emergency situation is the role of the government, right? But UNICEF is committed to support this, this role. Cases which ranges from uh, malaria, cholera, and other diseases do arise, you know, in some of these communities. And it is for that reason that the partners are all brought together to sit down and uh, devise a more enhanced uh, techniques and approach to respond to these issues. The agencies have pledged to provide support and guidance to the state in developing effective emergency preparedness plans. Contingency planning is, uh, is not only related to more effectiveness, but also uh, efficiencies. Through this, uh, we want to have a community, we would like to support the government in have a community better prepared and in the long run, eventually more resilience to shocks. It is therefore our collective responsibility to equip ourselves with our necessary skills, knowledge, regarding to mitigate the impacts of this crisis and to ensure a safety of the well-being of our most vulnerable among us. The state governments have expressed their commitment to working with NEMA, UNICEF and other stakeholders to enhance their capacity for risk analysis and emergency response. By prioritizing preparedness and resilience building efforts, the states hope to safeguard the lives and livelihoods of their residents in the face of ongoing challenges. In Maiduguri for New Central, you're watching News Central Television. Let's take a short break. Stay with us.